Hey friends, in today's video, you will learn how to seamlessly switch the slides between light mode and dark mode with a simple mouse click action in PowerPoint. Take a look at this little icon. Every time I click it, the slides transform effortlessly from light to dark mode and vice versa. Impressive, isn't it? Now, if you recall, in my last video, I walked you through creating impressive animated team intro slides. The video link is in the I button. If you missed it, I highly recommend checking it out first and then continue watching this video. And here's a friendly tip. If you're new to this channel or haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It's just a click away. Now, without further ado, let's dive into the video. We already have our four slides in light mode from the previous video. Select all four slides, right-click, and choose Add Section. Name the section Light Mode and press Enter. Right-click again, select Add Section, and name it Dark Mode, then press Enter. Copy the four light version slides and paste them under the Dark Mode section. Now that we've set up our sections, we'll start modifying the dark mode slides. I already have a color palette with dark mode theme colors. I'm pasting it for reference on all slides. Go to the fifth slide, select the background rectangle, right click and choose format shape. Use the eyedropper tool to fill it with the first dark color from the palette. Select these name text boxes and fill them with the gray color. Apply the gray color to all subtitle text boxes. Fill the title box text with the second dark color. For the rounded rectangle shape, fill it with the second color from the palette. Under Picture Effects, select the shadow color as white and set the transparency to 85%. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus C to copy the properties of the rectangle shape and press Ctrl plus Shift plus V to paste them onto the other shapes. These steps are repetitive for slides 6, 7 and 8. So I'm fast forwarding a bit to save your time. Feel free to slow down if needed. Now let's hyperlink the name text boxes to the respective dark mode slides. On the fifth slide, select the first name text box, go to the insert tab and click on action. Hyperlink it to slide six like this. Repeat this for the second name text box link to slide seven and the third text box link to slide eight. Copy all the hyperlinked name text boxes. Move to the sixth slide, remove the existing name text boxes, and paste the hyperlinked ones in the correct positions. Repeat this process for the seventh and eighth slides. Now, let's relink the background rectangle. Select the rectangle, 
go to the Insert tab and click on Action. Select slide 5 from the list and click OK. Copy this hyperlinked rectangle and go to the sixth slide. Delete the existing background rectangle and paste the copied one. Right-click on the rectangle and tap on Send to Back. Repeat this process for the seventh and eighth slides. Next, add an icon of your choice and follow these steps. Resize and position the icon as desired. Make sure it is in black color. Copy the icon and paste it on all slides. In the dark mode slides, change the color to gray and rotate it like this for smooth animation. Copy this rotated icon and place it on all remaining slides. Now, let's set up hyperlinks for a smooth transition between light and dark mode. Select the icon from the first slide and go to the Insert tab. Click on Action and select slide 5 from the list. This is the exact match of the dark version of slide 1. Repeat this process for the icons on slide 2, linked to slide 6, slide 3, linked to slide 7, and slide 4, linked to slide 8. Now we have to backlink the dark mode slide icons to their matching light mode slides. Select the icon, go to the Insert tab, and click Action. Select slide 1 from the list. This is the exact matching light version of slide 5. Repeat this process for the icons on slide 6, linked to slide 2, slide 7, linked to slide 3, and slide 8, linked to slide 4. That's it. Now, let's see the results in presentation mode. You'll notice that the text boxes and icon hyperlinks work flawlessly, providing a seamless transition between light and dark mode with a simple click of the icon. Feel free to share your thoughts on this video in the comments section. Your feedback is greatly appreciated. Hope you can make your own using this tutorial. If you really like this video, you will like this playlist as well. Do check it out. Give a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. We will meet you in the next video. Until then, bye. Signing off, The Slide Master.